Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Uh, today I'm really really excited to be reacting to Taman's Guilty. Yay! It's been a while since Taman released any solo songs and I'm always excited for them because Taman is in the forefront of the artistic direction of the music video. What he does with Shiny tends to fit in the Chinese known style but Taman tends to experiment with quite different genre sounds and the end result is always impressive. So I've been holding off from watching this. It's been like 12 or 10 days since this has been released. I've been working a lot lately so I barely had the time for myself. But yeah, I'm very stoked to finally have the opportunity to be able to react to Taman's Guilty. For those of you who are watching me for the first time, hi, I'm Saijan. I've been a shovel since 2010. I started with um, Lucifer, but my first exposure to Shiny was in 2009 with Rin Dim Dong. So I'm quite of a seasoned shovel, and I've always been a tamant. So that's the perspective that you're gonna get with this video. Without further ado, let's talk about the details of the music clip. It is for 3 minutes and 39 seconds, and the quality goes up to 4K. So you can enjoy this in crisp quality. So without further ado, let's crack on and see what this video has to offer. Shout out to uh, my friend from South Korea that asked me to react to this. Uh, this one is also for you. Let's go. Story uh, uh, Yes. Poison apple. you wanna take a bite? So keep Just a little more this that's more English lines than I'm used to in a Tame In music clip because, yeah. Um, excuse me, I'm going to turn off the subtitles because I find them distracting. I want to focus on the melody and the music clip. So what I find interesting with this is the dance is quite lyrical. I think this is called like a lyrical dance where we, you can really feel the lyrics expressed in the music clip. I'm getting a very serious Koharu choreography. For those of you who don't know, a a Koharu is a Japanese dancer and a choreographer that Tammy and has a history of working with and Koharu is exceptionally talented when it comes to expressing lyrical intensity through intense uh, motions and you know twitching and tantalizing movements so I feel a I feel like this choreography may have been made by Koharu I love Taemin's hair by the way. I always found Taemin so much more interesting with long hair because obviously he's a dancer and his hair swings when it's long and that it kind of gives like an oomph to his movements. So that's really really cool. 
Wow, what's a great costume. You see these kind of like, I don't want to say tribal, but like communal dance, dance gestures, dance choreography, with Tamin standing in the middle. It, first of all, this is one of the key features of any Tamin choreography. Uh, the backup dancers are kind of like a, a very integral part of the actual choreography, and they're not just like set pieces. They have active roles and they're a part of the show. And Taemin stands in the middle, gives that uh, performance where we focus on his vocals. His vocals are impressive, by the way. I'm already impressed with uh, this music clip. It's everything that I expected from Taemin, and he delivers on every front. <laughs> I love his costume too. I was just thinking, this is the Goblet of Fire of Taemin, <laughs> Taemin music clips, like from Harry Potter, because he has this long and messy, like, unkept hair. Asthma? I can relate. <laughs> oh, ouch. Very good English pronunciation, by the way. <laughs> It's kind of a funny scene stuff. Okay, I'm not gonna pause as much. Skills bomb, skills bomb, so so good. Timmy, I feel good and bad at the same time to be the same age as Timmy, because look at how good he is. Ah, oh, that was so good. Okay, one thing that I was holding off from saying is that I love when Timmy kind of mixes different levels of his vocals together towards the end to uh, signify the climax. I love that about Taemin's songs because it gives such a sense of completion, the heightenance of emotions towards the end. I am a huge fan. He does the same with Criminal, like towards the end, you like, I want to just scream and sing the song at the same time because it is so satisfying to have this gradual increase towards the end and at the end like with the mixture of a bunch of different levels of uh, vocals you kind of really get the sense of this okay we are reaching the climax this is the big finale it's the end he does that amazingly with his music clips dance and tone wise I feel like this may be a combat I was getting a little bit of uh, flame of love was it like the flame of love yeah I was getting kind of like flame of love vibes and towards the beginning I was like getting uh, Sayonara Hitori vibes too like especially when he is alone but the setting gives me the sense of like press your number because it's kind of like an American setting this may have been recorded in the United States uh, this is actually wait 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 I, I'm seeing this for the first time. This is actually like a very famous Turkish branded car. Oh, where is it? Come on. Oh my God! Yeah, <laughs> this is like 
they're very um yeah this is like a very turkish brand car well maybe not this style i'm sure it's not turkish but uh, like the style is very familiar i think it's shahin car i don't know we don't have this kind of a back where it's like extends that often but i mean they may be any car from the 90s of america so maybe i'm going off nowhere this music club obviously this song obviously has more english lines uh, and Tevin's pronunciation has gotten a lot better i'm very proud of this boy he speaks korean japanese english he sings he dances his acting got better too i mean you should have seen him <laughs> early 2010s <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, very proud of him. I don't know if he speaks any other languages. He plays the piano. Um, at one performance of Shiny, they were playing electric guitars, but I don't think they were actually playing it. So overall, uh, this is everything I wanted out of uh, Tayman. It's very uh, on character, on character, in character uh, of him. Very much in his style. Uh, it didn't really blow me away, but it all ticked the right boxes. This is overall a great song, uh, and I'm really proud of Taemin, and I am proud of myself to be able to distinguish what is this like Taemin style of song. I think he established his own style. At the beginning, it was like at the beginning of his solo debut, uh, his style was heavily influenced by Michael Jackson, but after the influence of Koharu, his own. Um, you know experimentations especially with the move and advice he kind of solidified that style of his which is very enjoyable i loved him in, as a solo artist solo singer as i said this is not a very shiny style song because they have their own style this is very tamin style and i've been starving for some tamin songs i held myself off from listening to the song as well this was my first time hearing it because i wanted this to be a genuine reaction and i'm so happy that i did yeah uh, i've been reacting to many tamen music clips on my channel you can find them i've even reacted to the first one uh i was i had more hair back then but yeah <laughs> thank you guys so much for watching definitely let me know what you think about this music clip in the comments below uh, sorry that I'm uh, so late to have this recorded and I don't even know if I'm going to be late uh, to upload this but I'll try to be as fast as I can for me uh, this music clip is like a solid 9 out of 10 uh, it is very natural it's not it's not k-pop at all I mean it is k-pop but not in the usual sense where it is very flashy and very extravagant not that there's anything wrong with it, but I like that Taemin tries many different things and gives us the best version of uh, his trials and experimentations. Whatever he does, I'm sure he puts his heart and soul into it. He's such a hardworking um, artist and I couldn't be more proud. I kind of take him as like a role model. Uh, I'm not. I don't dance, but <laughs> I like to think of myself as a hardworking person. But yeah, okay. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in another reaction video. Bye bye.